Hello, Les from Thailand here. Today's video is going to be about holidaying around Thailand on a budget. Um, I like my holidays, but we never pay a lot for hotel rooms because we, in reality, you just sleep in a hotel room or you use the hotel facilities and we're all here, there and everywhere discovering new places. So we're out and about most of the time. So what we're going to do over the next couple of months or so is go to various locations stay in budget accommodation and then share the videos here on YouTube for what the location, what there is to see, how much it costs. Now our budgets range from 500 baht a night up to maybe 1200 baht a night and again that's sort of a, a decent budget you can get some really nice hotels for, for that type of price and for instance we've just come back from Trat. Uh, now Trat where we stay and I'll put some photographs and you can see the, the type of accommodation that we stayed in it was lovely and the cost to stay here was 700 baht a night in a, a modern resort area and you can see by the, the photographs of the rooms they were a decent size decent finish the air conditioning worked really really well the, the ensuite bathrooms all very modern and up to date and if you wanted to stay in a, in a traditional Thai style house, well then that, that was between 900 and 1200 baht a night, depending on location. If it was near the swimming pool, where you'll see some photographs there, the houses that were near a swimming pool, they were a little bit more expensive. And the, some of the other houses there, they were overlooking the river, so they're a little bit away from the swimming pool. And again, they were a little bit cheaper at 900 baht per night. But that included breakfast, uh, it was American style breakfast, you can see by the menu with the photograph. And the, the breakfast was, was fairly good, for inclusive of the price of 700 baht a night. There's a, a bit of a water park there at the moment, you'll see some pictures there. Now these pictures are from the last time we were there, because now that the resort is going to reopen, they're going to renew the water slides. They're going to renew the, the soft play areas on the water and they're just basically going to spend some money on the resort to, to attract more people to come to the resort. Now we stayed there for two days and a lot of, we never left the resort for two days, it was fun. We went with a group of people, there was eight of us all together, so we had lunch there, evening meal there, the food that they served was very reasonably priced and very very nice also. We had a few bottles of beer as you do and bottles of wine or whatever but we never left the resort for two days. It was a good good entertainment for eight of us all together. And the staff just couldn't do enough to please you. They were more than happy to help you. The resort itself has got a, an 8.9 on the booking.com so it's got some really, really good reviews. And I've got to say 10 out of 10. I couldn't have followed, followed the place. If the soft play area on, on the water was open, then I would have given it 10 out of 10, for sure, because then all the facilities were there. But I understand it's been closed for three or four months now because of this COVID, and it's just starting to reopen now. So I'll put the, the link on the resort just below. It's well worth a visit if you're anywhere near the track. And it's 700 baht a night. It's cheap as chips very very nice location very very nice by the river very relaxing so if you like this video give it a thumbs up if you don't like it give it a thumbs down please leave comments below if you would like to subscribe that'd be brilliant as i say i'm going to do a lot more videos on holidays and budget hotels and what to see and what to do and where to go around the thailand area that we're in the rayong area so please Watch the rest of my videos. Watch some of the other videos that I've already done. Hope it's been of good use to you. And from Liz, living the dream in Thailand. Until the next time, bye for now.